Hello everyone, welcome to DG Bytes. I am Vavo Gupta, your Alteryx expert, and today we are going to learn about another interesting tool of Alteryx that is Output Tool. We will also learn that how we can play around with its configuration to write files in different ways. Then why wait? Let's start. Alteryx output is one of the most interesting tool of Alteryx because it generates an output for you. It may be in the form of Excel file, flat file, YXDB file or many more extensions or you can directly write it to the uh, database, maybe SQL Server, Oracle or any other database that you are utilizing or you can directly publish it to tools like Tableau, Power BI or many other applications. It totally depends upon your requirement. But for this particular video, our focus is to see uh, a output that has been written to an Excel file and how we can play around with the output tool configuration to generate output in different ways. So for that, let's drag in an input data set. So for that, I will drag in here an input data tool. Then I will select a file Let's say I will just directly select a recent file and click on OK and run this. So I have three columns with city, grade and salary. I will drag in directly now an output tool. So it's asking me to write a file or database. So I will select here and uh, let's say i want to write it as a .xlsx file and i will select a location let's say i want to write it here on c alteryx and uh, select uh, our name as output.xlsx and click on save it will ask me for the sheet name, let's say salary and click on OK. So my output is generating at this particular path and here I have multiple configurations. So it says whether I can create a new sheet, append to existing sheet, overwrite sheet or range, overwrite file, create new sheet. So as I'm creating this file and sheet for the first time, so I will directly run it. So uh, once I run it, my file will be created at the desired location, which is at this folder, C Alteryx. So you can see here, output file has been generated. If we see here the output, you can see all these three columns has been written to this particular file. So if I close it now and go back to Alteryx, and again run this with the same configuration. You can see uh, there has been an error. It says this sheet Alteryx uh, already exists uh, and uh, the file is already there. So it means that uh, with the same configuration because this sheet is already existing and we are saying create new sheet. So it can directly not overwrite it because we are just giving the instruction to create a new sheet. So it is throwing an error. So in this case, if you want to overwrite that sheet again, then we have to select an option overwrite sheet or range. So in this case, what will happen? The file will be there, but the sheet will be overwritten. So I will click here on run. So the sheet has been recreated. Let's say now I add a sheet name as salary one here and run it. So this time it threw no error because the sheet name got changed to salary one due to which a new sheet has been added to the file. So if I go back to the file I, and I see, I can see two sheets, salary and salary one. Now again, I will close this. So let's go back to Alteryx and let's now uh, say overwrite file. 
so till now we were overwriting sheet but now we will overwrite file so in this case what will happen is there were two sheets in the file salary and salary one but now as i am deleting or overwriting the file there will be only single sheet in this case because this will be overwritten entirely so if i run it now and go back to the file and see it you can see there is only one sheet with salary one so this is what the changing in configuration can result in now we have another option where we say append to existing sheet so now let's say i want to append the data in the same sheet so i will click here append to existing sheet so again my data is this time will be doubled in the sheet so let's go and check so you see the data has been doubled here because i have appended the data to the same sheet with the same data set so this is what these different configurations of output can, tool can be manipulated and utilized as per your requirement in case you have any doubts you can mention in the comments or write us on the email id that has been given in the description section thank you for watching our videos and to subscribe our channel